Greetings and welcome to another edition of The Shape of the Cape. Here you are with your host Jules Cape on the South Cape coast of Africa. Today we're visiting one of the most beautiful treasure holiday resorts known as Plettenberg Bay. This is one of the finest holiday resorts on the entire garden route frequented by millionaires annually. It's a place where the whales come to carve in the winter months every year and you can see them here appearing. It's midsummer today, a beautiful area. Unfortunately, uh, it's uh, completely misted over, which is a very interesting concept. Still very warm. We have a temperature of about 28 degrees Celsius. Uh, this morning mist will clear in a little while and uh, we should have a beautiful day ahead. It's uh, quite warm, hot and humid and we should have some clear sun in a little while. This is uh, in front of us, the Indian Ocean and in the distance just behind it you have the lagoon. That's the Kirbuams River Lagoon. A beautiful place for canoeing and uh, water sports. So it's a very impressive area. I do recommend a little visit sometime. If you ever want to, you can come and explore and see the whales during uh, August, September, around about that time in winter. Uh, the whales uh, feature right here in the beach and you can see them uh, from this perfect viewpoint and uh, fortunately they have been protected in recent years uh, and there was a massive amount of whaling of course in the 1800s uh, many whales have come past here and been hunted from what used to be a whaling station in this particular area today of course uh, they are protected all around the world it's tragic to hear how many tens of thousands were hunted and killed in the, the early 20th century uh, almost to extinction although they have returned in recent years not quite to their fullest but uh, fortunately protected it is those few like the Japanese and uh, others perhaps some Scandinavian countries who still think uh, it's okay to hunt whales uh, it is unfortunate, but where there's money to be made, of course, this is what will happen. Uh, nature comes second when uh, there's profit in the modern world designed uh, by capitalist uh, bankers to exploit the situation. So at least here they are being preserved and protected, and you can come and see them as they carve every year and have... Uh, stop here in the warmer waters on the way down to the Antarctic. Even this morning uh, the mist will clear soon. I'm already perspiring. It's so warm. This hot humid condition is really amazing. Uh, very pleasant. Uh, some people in the sea down below. So if you ever get the opportunity any time of the year you can come for a visit Enjoy the lagoon, go canoeing upriver, enjoy some surfing, whale watching, uh, even dolphins uh, every day moving past. I can see a school of dolphins down below just now, the little black tips sticking out in the distance. Uh, it might be hard to see it on the actual screen, but they're there. So. Do come and visit when you get the chance. It's a great place. I highly recommend it. One of the best parts of the entire garden route in South Africa. So this is Jules Cape showing you the treasures of the Cape here. And until next time when we explore another exciting treasure hideaway. This is Jules Cape in the shape of the Cape. Plettenberg Bay signing out.